She's starting to warm up to me, which is very nice. <gasps> oh, who's this pretty girl? Oh, okay, okay, we'll pick you up. Ah, good day everyone and welcome back to another crazy adventure on the channel of rescuing another animal. This time it's not a pregnant animal. She already gave birth. It's a cat. So I'm here at San Bernardino Rescue to pick her up. I'm here with Oscar. Hello, back again. The I feel like team. deja vu. This happens like every couple months. <laughs> There's a new woman in need of my assistance. So I'm here to pick up this gorgeous, beautiful, stunning white and gray cat. What would she be called? I don't know the breed. I don't know the breed. She's gorgeous. Here's a picture that I saw on Facebook. To even get here to rescue this cat is such a process. I did not realize how intense it is to rescue from a shelter. They make it so difficult that it's kind of annoying. So I found her on this post on Facebook and I reached out and the woman who posted it sent me to a woman who sent me to another woman who sent me to a rescue that I had to sign up for and go through this whole process. And then I found out that only reapproved rescues can even rescue from certain shelters. So they make it very difficult and I feel like some changes need to be made, but I'm here to pick up the mama and her five babies. I hope she's a friendly woman. And I hope she's a little bitch. I hope she <laughs> no. I hope she uh, oh my God. Just to make things interesting. I've had too many sweet one. You better take spicy. that back. You better take that back. <laughs> I'm scared of cats that are mean. So we're just waiting for them to call us in and then we're gonna go get the little girl. So little. Okay. Oh, sweet girl. So little. Hi. Oh my god, she's so pretty. Oh. Wow, she looks so magical. I love her. Whoa, look at those beautiful eyes. We gotta tie her up. Okay, let's go home. Let's get you home. Okay, so we're in Sakura's room. This is gonna become yet to be named Tat's room. I'm gonna release her right now and just see what she does. I think she'll stay in here. I don't think she'll really come up to explore yet. Hi. Oh, wow. You are so small. Mm. Look at these little nuggets. Oh my gosh, the white one. Oh, the little yawns. Look at this little white nugget. That one is so cute. Their eyes are still closed. I wonder if the white one's gonna have blue eyes. Well, I was thinking I could like make, maybe scoot this bed over. Oh yeah. And like create an area over here and just put a like border up right here so they can't escape. Yeah, oh wow, this is a Kura flashback. Okay, so I'm gonna pull the things out from here and then I'll slide that over. I'm just trying to think how small I should make it though. She'll make it tight, Yeah. don't we all? Maybe that was a little too tight. I think that's good. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Nice and cozy. This is so squishy. I have like a dog bed underneath here. So I'm just gonna leave that in there so she'll feel like this is a safe place because she's already kind of been nesting in there. I can tell she's a little nervous. Remember Sakura? Uh, thank God there's no drawers for her to hide. I know. This <laughs> room is literally fully cat and kitten proof at this point. Oh, where is she, where is she going? Joey. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I left and I came back in here and I come over and she ate food, but she's gone. I literally don't know where she is. Maybe she's in this pool. Maybe she's hiding in. Hello? Oh my god, where did she go? Okay, maybe she's under the bed. Are you under here? Oh, she is. I can see her. What are you doing in there? How did you get under there? She's probably nervous. You gotta block this up so she can't get under there with the kitten. Sakura tried doing this too. I completely forgot that I blocked it up. Okay, so I lifted it up. It's like hinged on that. I know. I know. It's scary, but you can't come under here. Okay, so I was able to get her out and I'm just like trying to like calm her down because she's obviously really nervous, but it's so crazy just how small she is. Look at how skinny she is. She's so little. I'm gonna put her back with her baby and then I'm gonna 
block this off. Okay, good. She's back in there. How are your babies? Are they eating? Uh oh, Sakura's out here. She's like, hello? I know there's some bitch in there. I know she's in there. Oh, hi, Miss Sakura. Do you know that there's a woman in there? You do? What do you think of her? My God, there's room for everybody. Let's just say that. Are you jealous? <gasps> oh my gosh, you have so much to say about her. She's friendly, she's so sweet. Is she gonna be your best friend? Listen, the way you treated Azula is not gonna fly with this girl, okay? You need to be nice. Yeah, you need to be nice. Okay, I've had enough of your sass. Don't give me that sassafras, ma'am. I'm leaving. I'm gonna go cheat on you. I'm going in there right now to go pet her and not you. How does that make you feel? Who's this beautiful woman? You've already eaten three whole cans of food in one day. You are so hungry. We're gonna get you nice and fat, okay? I want to see your babies. Would it be okay if I looked at your babies? I want to see the kittens. I want to bring them out into the good light and show you guys what they look like. Our first baby. Oh my god, the eyes are starting to open. Hello, little nugget. What's your name gonna be? The little meow. Oh my god, so little. Okay, let's put you back. Oh, look at this gray one. You're so beautiful. You're just a little gray kitty. Look at the little face. Happy, gentle. Another striped one. Very little. Hi. Good little kitty. Are you sleeping? This black one's so cool. Hi. You're just a little black little kitty like Sakura. You're so cool looking. Last but not least, the white one. Hi. Are you gonna look just like your mommy? Oh my god, so cute. Okay, let's go back. So I just fed her another can and she came out very quickly. Yeah, she's a hungry mommy. I still just can't get over how little she is. I'm feeding her kitten wet food so she can get lots of nutrients and really just fatten her up. Oh, do you like butt scratches like Sakura? She's so long. She literally reminds me of dragon. I need to name her something after a dragon. Oh, was she out exploring today? She just had a snack and now she's out wandering. You are so beautiful. Oh, you want more? I was so hungry. <laughs> so I've taken the babies out to give mommy a little break and also to see what their coloring looks like under natural light. Actually, it's been a couple days since I got them. They're growing so fast. Some of their eyes are starting to open. This is so sweet. Hi, little nuggets. Okay, so I have some exciting news for those of you who are Escape the Night fans. As you may know, last year I did a Kickstarter for an Escape the Night board game and a lot of people were asking if it would ever be on sale again. And the answer to that is yes. This is the last time that it will be on sale on my Crystal Wolf store. I was able to order an extra amount from the order with the Kickstarter so I could sell those on my store. So there is a limited amount left that will be available if you guys did not get to purchase it on the Kickstarter. So I want to show you guys because I have them. A lot of you guys have been receiving them from the Kickstarter. Sakura, you're so loud. Sakura is going to order one. But I want to show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so first of all, there's a very, very, very small amount of the standard edition box, which is so gorgeous. I love this box so much. That's the back of it. It has all the standard pieces. But the premium edition, I want to show you guys everything that's in it. So there's... There's a lot that's actually in this board game. So this is obviously the board. These are the extra tiles. These are the player pieces. Nothing's punched out right now. But I just want to give you guys a sense of the quality that is in this box because it is very high quality. Like the back of the cards is like this gorgeous gold foil. So if you're a fan of Escape the Night and you want to feel like you are in the world, definitely go try this game out. You will feel like you are immersed in the world. There's just a lot that goes into this. You'll get a post Poster. You'll get a signed card for me. This is the rule book. So there's a lot that comes in this So I'll put a link down below if you guys are interested in getting it It will be available May 21st So you can go pre-order it and get it in like a week or so And also if you guys do 
get it, please post pictures on Twitter or Instagram, tag me and I'll be reposting. And it's just cool to see you guys playing the board game that I created. There's also some new Escape the Night merch here that you can see that comes in a bundle. So if you wanna get the bundle, it will be much cheaper than buying individually. So go check it out, link will be down below. Anyways, let's go back and check on the kitties one last time. She's starting to warm up to me, which is very nice. Would you like some scratchies? Oh, yeah. Oh, who's this pretty girl? Oh, okay, okay, we'll pick you up. Sorry, I guess we're not at that level yet. But anyways, I'm going to try and think of some names for her and the baby. So if you guys have any suggestions, please let me know. You guys know I love a theme, so I'd like to keep the names in a theme. And I'm probably gonna go vlog over on my vlog channel, doing a little gender reveal to see what they even are. So if you wanna go subscribe to my vlog channel, I will leave that as a link below as well if you're not already subscribed. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this journey of rest doing this mommy and her babies. I absolutely love doing this. So I'm excited for this journey to come. So if you guys did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and lets me know that you guys enjoy these journeys as well. But that's it for today. I love you guys. Until next time, I'll see you next time. Good day. Bye.